This is World Mag Magazine. My name DJ Tate. We're here with Miss Desire representing. I don't want to say the UK anymore. She just representing the world. Miss Desire, how are you feeling tonight? I'm good. How are you? I I I I I I. I, I, I. <laughs> okay. For people who don't know who Miss Desire is, mm -hmm. give them a brief synopsis of who. Well, oh. I'm Miss Desire. Class is a UK soccer artist. Um, I have heritage in Barbados and Jamaica, um, and I just love soccer music. Which party rep? Which part? Yeah. Barbados to the fullest. All right. <laughs> then. So, Miss Desire, she's been around for, what, five, six years now? S seven. Seven? Wait. Seven. Seven years. 2008. 2008. Yes. Yes. I've been drinking. <laughs> so, Miss Desire, how was last crop over for you? Crop over was great. It was fantastic. The vibes was nice. Um, it's just really good to see Bajan Soka coming back mm -hmm. to where it used to be. Um, it had a, a while where Bajan Soka was a bit lost. A bit disappeared. Yeah, a bit disappeared, a bit lost. But now it's really coming up to the forefront. We've got like King Bubba, Hyper Sounds, and there's like a lot of people that is doing it for Bajan Soka music right now. So Crop Over was a blast. The vibe was good. I can let's ask talk, more. Let's talk more about you. You mentioned some big names. What, what can we look forward from you for the next couple of years or before we even reach the future what we're gonna do we're gonna go back what's one of your proudest achievements for oh my god um one of the proudest achievements i have was actually winning uk soca monarch the groovy monarch in mm. 2012 that was great i'm working with precision productions out of trinidad and tobago mm -hmm. um casey is really good on vocal production and yeah. ashwin is really good on production as boss, is. yes um so they are my one of my proudest achievements good. so far and what will top that in the future um topping that in the future would Winning again, <laughs> <laughs> winning again, um, and just continuing. You know what? What would make me r proud right now is having a song where I could sing it, and the audience of wherever I perform knows the lyrics, knows the songs, and can vibes along with me. That's what I really, really want right that's now. That's your wish. Yes, that's, that's my uh, wish. That's my wish. The Soka God. <laughs> we need this. We need a song that. <laughs> So one thing I have to say about the UK, how come you won't collaborate with another UK artist? It's not that. Or I is that political? <laughs> no. Okay. It's not that I won't um, collaborate with UK artists. Is mm. it's all about timing. All right. Um, and a lot of us represent different islands, so a lot of the time we're out of the islands. Mm. Well, we're out of the UK in it's time that we could. Yes, that that <laughs> we could collaborate. Um. But it's not that I don't want to. It's just really all about timing, all about production, all about organic feeling. It's not just, gotcha. oh, let's do a tune and we got to force it. It's more organically. Um, all right. The next person that I really want to work with is Tara Dan. Tara Dan. Yes. He performed well. Yes, very well today, actually. He performed well. Mm -hmm. So we're here with Miss Desire closing that interview. What can we look forward to from you for the next year? Next year, I have a lot of goodies coming out. Um, a ladies' anthem next mm -hmm. year. Um, we're working on the EP for next year and a lot, a lot of tunes, music videos and everything. You can just look for everything. And as well, I want to say congratulations. Ah, thank you. <laughs> this has been DJ Tape for World Mag, Miss Desire. Out.